Okay then, one more video today. Um, we are here for chapter 11. Okay, so there are a few new questions. Aiden has been approached to help promote an F1 sim racing event. He agreed to take part without consulting with us first and the event has already announced this petition. Participation on social media. Should we still let him attend this? Yeah. Okay, that's all we actually need to do. Why are you hesitating? You've always dreamt of racing in F1. Finally. Not like this. Do you know what he did? Oh, your father? What? Refused to support me. Said he'd only find one of his girl. children. Said Devon had better prospects. I can see that. Sorry. I didn't know that. Mum used the divorce settlement to help me out, but... And you're only here because he sent you. No. This was my idea. My decision. And this is me asking you, Callie, not your father. We need a replacement and ask for you because I know how good you are. She is good. And that's the truth. Well, I'm good, you know. I always said I'd do it on my terms, not his. I'll look out for you. Just like I did in F2. You yes, you did. Me? I'll do everything in my power, everything, to make sure that all you have to think about is driving. And driving as fast as possible. We've got a deal. Come on, the new signing for the Connor Sports F1 team. You might never get this opportunity again. You know that. Chapter 11. With the world watching, Kelly looks to make history as she approaches her first start behind the wheel of an F1 car. Can we actually do it? Can we get a good result? Are we driving as Kelly Mayer or are we still driving as Aiden Jackson? I think the most logical thing would be that we are driving as Kelly Mayer. Today oh, we are at the start of the Grand Prix. Becomes the first female driver okay. In modern era to participate in an F1 race. What a moment. I've got goosebumps. Now, for those oh no, something is going wrong here. I can feel it. Women have entered at least one Grand Prix over the years, but none have even had the opportunity to qualify since 1992. Italy's Giovanna Amati, for those of you wondering. So today is very much a new dawn here in Baku. Why are they waiting so long? Qualifying. So let's see what the Grand Prix has in store for her. Yeah, I have to say, it is quite a tight-knit pack out there. Biggest competition all round. Ahead of a Haas. Indeed. We've seen some brilliant driving here today, especially from young Callie Mayer. She seems to have made the transition to F1 as if she was born for it. Can we drive now? Okay, primary objective. What is it? Catch up to Jackson before okay, lap eight. Where is he? So we have three laps to get to P12. Shouldn't be too difficult as we are a superstar. Oh, what a beautiful move. And we are up into P15. Only three more spots to go. But we only have to catch up. We don't actually have to overtake him. Come on. Where's our DRS? Here it is. Let's overtake Norris as soon as possible so that we can hunt. Oh, our car is not having it today. Sunoda, come on. A bit faster, please. But the 8 gear just stopped working for a second there. Oh, sorry. And overtake on Snood as well, around your side. Thank you very much. I like outside overtakes much more than I like uh, inside overtakes. Because with the outside line, you have a better exit. Most of the time, then. And we are already at the back end of Jackson. That was fast. Oh no, they are going to crash. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. 
drivers. Jackson's out. He gets the worst of it. May is clear. Oh, Jackson's damage looks bad. I think what the hell? The race is over. May has seemed to catch Jackson unawares, though. I'm not sure why. What was that? Why didn't she wait for me to move over on the exit? Okay, Aiden, are you alright? Oh my god. They were so stupid. Objective updated. Finish in the top 10. How many laps do we have left? Yeah, I know, Callie. I'm sorry about that, but it's happened now. It's over. Let's get your head down and focus. Come on. Okay, come on. Let's get us into the top 10. P12. Do we still need to pit or not? No. What a beautiful overtake that is. You can see the gap coming down already. Gained a second in just a few corners. Maybe the AI is set too low. Okay, let's wait for Russell to give us some DRS. And then we can breeze past him. We could probably do it without DRS as well. So let's stay alongside. Get to DRS and move past them. Four seconds is what we need to gain in five in laps. Keep it up. Press. Let's try to get them before the castle section. You will be slow. Around your sides. Come on. Yes. Already up to P9 and Stroll in P8 is only a second ahead of me now. Is it me or is the AI just slow? Yeah, I'm going to overtake him here. Otherwise I would lose too much. Not worth my time. Oh! I didn't see Stroll there. Didn't even get any notification that it was in any way close to me. But Gasly now 1.3 ahead. Probably do the same to him as we did to Perez. Yeah, we'll do the same to him as we did Perez just last lap. Or we might even do this. We might do something new. Yes, we do something new and we are up into P7. We might even get to the top 5 because we are so much faster than them. It's ridiculous. Inside line, we do something different every time we overtake somebody. Okay. You can see every lap another car and every time another move. So we'll probably get the S3. Around your side here. Simply lovely. Job done. 10 seconds. I don't think we'll get that in two laps. You can see how much we gain on him every single corner. It's ridiculous. Or maybe even something new. Something new about this overtake will be, we'll do it as this corner. And let's go. Let's be four. Yes, we hit the wall, we don't care. And now the top three is too far ahead. Let's just end it. Um, let's just finish this race in B4. I think that's good enough. Not too bad, not too bad. That's all I can say about it. Let's use our ERS and finish this race as quickly as possible. So that we can see if there's a cutscene or if we just end the video. Check a flag, B4. Nice. Let's see, post-race, chapter 11. Not an ideal start. A misunderstanding between the new teammates forces Aiden to retire from the race in Baku. Uh... And do you feel extra pressure at Connor Sport? It must be difficult with your dad looking over your shoulder. <sighs> Look, it's F1. It's not possible for me to feel any more pressure than I already do. So no, it's not an issue. Kelly, have you felt any pushback from anyone in the F1 world? Just with you being the first female driver in the sport? No, 
everyone's been amazing. And I'm not the first, I'm just the latest. How's your brother? Are you really just keeping his seat warm? Uh, you'd have to ask him that. Um, but he is getting the help that he needs. And no, I have no intention of giving up this seat. What happened out there between you and Aiden today? Uh, it's just a mix-up. Um, I, I thought he was letting me through on the entry, but he clearly had other ideas. We spoke to him earlier, and he said he was deliberate on your part. Any comment on that? Uh, it was just a misunderstanding. You've always gone by mayor, and now you're in a team financed by your father, driving in your brother's seat. Would you go back to the butler name? Should have expected it, right? I thought you did. That's not what I mean. I mean, I'm a woman. I get it. I'm happy to talk about it. Then what is it? Well, it's always the same, isn't it? So you're a woman, and then every question about Dad, about Devon, about the butler, name. Just forget about it. Oh, I can never get away from it, can I? The only question about the race was about Aiden. Well, you know, maybe if we'd let it run a little longer, there would have been... Casper? Don't defend them. Oh, boy. Sorry. A woman is angry. Sorry. You have to watch out, then. It's fine. I'll be faster next time. Oh, ho, 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 ho. She finished before. What do you expect? She did it on purpose. She did do it on purpose. Yeah. Check the footage. So you didn't warm to her? We weren't the best of friends. No. Someone's angry. Okay, but we are Kelly Mayer and we managed to get before. And still a lot of drama. Thank you for watching. We'll move on to chapter 12 in the next video. If you haven't seen any other videos, well then go check it out on the channel. Subscribe to the channel, like the videos and comment what your favorite thing is so far about Breaking Point 2. And then I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.